Hi and welcome back to Warframe. Today we're going to build one of the melee weapons. I cannot decide which. Do we build the co comma? I mean, I, I like the way that's... There's like a bronze bit on the tip there. Or do we build that thing? That does look evil. Well, it doesn't actually look evil. Just I'm looking at the specs and with this quicker swing rate, that could be really powerful. Ooh, I don't know. We should, we really should. Now I'd love to have a like a voting system on YouTube. What should I build next? Please vote below. <laughs> and then I could have put it on the previous video when I put it. Now nah, we'll build this. Because the Ether stuff did tend to be good. So build the Ether Reaper. And I bet you this costs a stupid amount to build as well. Everything else has so far. Oh, that's not so bad. Ten Morphix is a lot. But that's just a Morphix. A thousand salv eh, ferrite. I know you said salvage. A thousand ferrite isn't really that bad. A thousand s bloody Rubido is, though. You know, a 1200 Rubido used to be the most expensive thing to build using Rubido. And now it's just... And you don't, Rubido doesn't drop everywhere, it's like the Plastide stuff. That's not that common a thing to come across. But anyway, it basically uses a thousand Polymer Bundle, a thousand Rubido, a thousand Ferrite, ten Morphix. Morphix tend to drop fairly recently. At least recently they've dropped a, a fair amount. So, well, then that's not so bad. If you need them, you can always just go farm Vore. He's easy enough to kill these days. Another 15,000. So this is another weapon that's costing us 65,000. It's going to take 12 hours. It better be better than that rifle though. And that rifle was okay. It wasn't amazing. It could have been better. The Grokata was a little bit better. But that's just because it did a lot more fire rate. But anyway, off topic. We'll build this one. <laughs> Come back when that one's done. Okay, so obviously when done, we'll claim this item has been added. I would bloody hope so. Go over to a vein weapon. That never got far. And equip the bad boy. Ah, that looks evil. I like it. I like it a lot. I just want to change red to orange. <laughs> I like it made any difference at all. It looks exactly the same. And that'll do me. Time to go kill some people with this thing. Oh, and it only has one polarity slot, which is a bit of a letdown. And it, again, it's not in the right place. It should be here. Oh, that swing rate makes it so much better. Oh, likey. I do think I'll put the range mod on that because it seems like its range is pretty poor. Well, mind you, that seems to be the only downside of this thing. Oh, death cube. Oh, Ooh, and a mod. Nice. Thank you. Does seem to have a nice range when you do a ground pound. Uh, that's our tally. Trying to think of bad points to this weapon, and I can't think of any. I mean, when it's on your back, it sticks out a hell of a lot, and that can be distracting. But they've made the blade see through, so you don't really notice it. Jeez, stop spawning. Oh, I really am trying to find a bad site with this weapon, and I just I can't find one. I 
I mean, it's naked. It hasn't even gone level 1 yet. And it's already a lovely, lovely little weapon. But then again, I've been using the machete. So it's it's obviously a lot better than the machete. Because the machete does a lot, lot, lot less damage. And I never really got that thing upgraded. Oh. I should have used the gram a little bit before I started using this because that thing's just overpowered to hell. Oh, mine is anyway. Oh, even the th one of the big things, like the hammer. I mean, the hammer, okay with the fire rate mod in and the charge rate and it's gone level 1. It can be just as quick as this. Hmm. Ah, uh, for the block it just does a little dance. That's a bit of a shame. Hmm. I haven't left this room yet. Let's leave this room. <laughs> Let's stop drooling over the weapon and carry on <laughs> with the mission. Ooh. Enemies. Ah, yawn. Oh, it's just, it is going to be a really, well, that popped up quick, a really nice weapon. Yeah, can you not get out the lasers, please? But, I mean, even until it gets there, it's still a really nice weapon. And there goes the window. That was silly. Really, really silly. But yeah, this weapon, it's... It's not overpowered, but it is going to be a really strong weapon. That fi uh, fire rate there is going to make it even better, though. Oops, try not to burp the microphone. So it does show a hell of a lot of promise of getting even better than it is. I mean, even the charge does not take that long. Oh, come on. Ah, you're all gonna die. Trying to go melee only as much as I can. Just isn't working out too well. Yeah, blue gas came out of that. Weird. Yeah, definitely one of those really nice weapons they've added in. Of course, because this is really good, that means the one I'm looking forward to is going to be crap. Because the rifle, eh, it was so-so. This thing is really nice. The dojo weapons might be okay. That means that melee weapon I'm looking forward to, which is the hammer. It's probably going to be rubbish. Oh, that's... Well, it's not going to be rubbish. It's still a good weapon. It's just... This is going to be better. So I'm probably going to build that and use this anyway. But we'll leave that off here for now. I'll build the camera probably in tomorrow. So I can get a little bit of time playing with this before I start playing with that. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time. Where's the exit?